Hello, 944 friends. Here we have an 87 944S with the twin cam engine. This one was bought from the insurance company and it has damage from a tree falling on it. So you can see broken windshield, roof damage, back glass is broken. Uh, primarily bought this for the engine and transmission. The interior is ratty. Uh, it does have a pretty nice looking little 2.5 liter 944S engine in it. We have just driven it around the parking lot to get all the gears and listen to the gearbox and listen to the motor. Motor feels and sounds good. Uh, we Looks like it's got some pretty recent attention, I believe on having the motor, at least the cylinder head done, or fresh water pump. Interior on this little car is ratty. Um, we really just sell major components on the cars and not little screws and widgets. It's got the aftermarket steering wheel and the aftermarket radio that's pretty decent. Interior's pretty tired though. One thing that a 944S has, and here is the option sticker that's in the back. And, of course, you see the engine transmission and VIN information on the top and then the option codes or the three-letter codes at the bottom. This one just has the regular open differential 935 ring and pinion 944S gearbox. The, you see it has that AGP code. Uh, the AGP is basically like a turbo as far as the innards of the transmission are large. The gears are a tiny bit wider. All the bearings, internal needle bearings inside are bigger. But the biggest thing is the head of the pinion is a little bit smaller than a tennis ball. And the normal early 944s, it's only a little bit bigger than a golf ball. So these transmissions are the best transmissions for the regular 944s as well as some people like them actually to put them in their turbo cars because they've got shorter gearing.